Hi everyone, I've just come to show you a little craft haul I got over the past week while I was out and about. Uh, the first one, sorry for the crinkling, this is a 12x12 12 12 I bought, it's um, Bronte Charm. I'm just trying to see how many pages, it's got 24 pages, um, hang on, it's not giving me any information whatsoever, I think there's two of each design and here's some of the designs the single sided most of them are floral but the beautiful shades and like vintagey which is what i like and i can't remember how much this was but i remember it was a real good bargain because i, I popped two in my basket it was such a good deal so that's that a 12 by 12 also i bought a load of napkins but some are still in the car um i've got a lot of deco patch products uh things coming up projects coming up so i got this sorry for the glare this is as you can see little teddy bear celebrations so i'll be doing some gift boxes with that i've got some i bought some boxes um, they were reduced but I didn't like the design so I'm going to sand them down and decker patch them all so I've got that I've got this this is gorgeous I paid a bit more than I normally would for this but absolutely gorgeous I got just the plain yellow the very thick these and I got another pack of, but as I say, they're in the car. So I don't do, I don't film all my hauls. So it might, uh, I might be able to show you or might not on the other packet. I bought some Heidi Swap products and I've got to say, I'm not keen on Heidi Swap designs. Um, I'm not going to open this because I've already shown this in a, another haul. I don't know if it was the same size as these ones I've bought here or slightly bigger, but you get six file folders with fancy tabs on, on them. But I'm not, not keen on all the designs at all. So that's that. Uh, and the, you might say, well, why did you buy more if you're not keen? I paid full price for the last lot and these were in the bin. And these were less than half what I paid. So for less than half price, yeah, I'll pick them up. So I got a pack of those. And I also got this Heidi Swap. Um, what's she calling it? A scrapbook kit. And you get four memory files. And they're a lot bigger than these. Oops. I don't know if you can see sorry this doesn't zoom out very much so you get four large memory files 10 stickers 25 rub-ons and a photo book and i'll open it up i've already opened it up and I'll... the photo book i wasn't keen on at all it's a bit ridiculous it's just some very very thin pieces of double-sided paper and let me see and that's it it's a bit ridiculous very thin as well so you get that there's your stickers these are your 25 rub-ons and then you get two small file folders and two large ones but I wouldn't call it a scrapbook kit but that's it also I got these I quite like these these are baby shower cards and envelopes and what I bought these for my baby albums now I love the envelopes and I'm going to put these in the baby albums as I say um, with, with one of these the baby shower and they can put the parents can put the scan photographs in there 
thought that would be a nice idea. The only thing, there is some pink in it, but it's mostly blue. So I don't know whether I'll put them in just the boy albums or boy Ango. So that was them. They were on a good deal. Um, just a little washi tape was reduced in the bin. Pick that up. Um, I went to various shops, I just didn't go to the one. I went to a few shops over the past week um, and picked stuff up. I got three of these and these are um, Christmas stamps. So they'll be ideal to put, they're all the same. They'll be ideal to put in a secret Santa that I'll be joining. And then there's this, um, i trying to see what this is, Forever Friends. Sorry, the price stickies there, but that word says fabulous. And then you've got a stamp of, of the bear, Forever Friends. So that was just some stamps. Also got a few inks because, well, I got that black one because that was half price and we all use tons of black, don't we? So I got that one. This wasn't reduced, but this is um, gold, bronze and silver. So I thought, well, that'd be ideal for crops. Save taking a load of colours with me. Just pop that in if I'm doing seasonal stuff. So that was the chewing pads. I bought these. I didn't see these till I was going out and they were by the tail. Um, nice little tin. And inside, if I can get them out. These lovely cards, 26 cards of fairies, but there's a good, about 10 of them that are not pictures of fairies like that. Um, so that's a little bit of a, a rip off when you're not getting fairies, but you're getting fairies as well. And the reverse side is that. So what I'll do, I'll just paste, um, some white cardstock or even paper because these are card and they can journal on that side and uh or use it as a photo mat and pop these in fairy albums that i've been making so that's another and then reuse the tin for something so that was that then i got some more of these me and my big idea journal cards I think I must have about 10 packs of these by now. Um, I did double up, um, bought some that I'd already bought. And I was fuming because all the ones up until this week I'd paid full price for. And these have all been reduced. They weren't half price, but they were reduced. So I think I'd already got that one. Um, the vacation one. Road trip. So that's that one. And I'd already had this. The birthday one. Now these, as I've stated before, are 72 cards. And I always said I wouldn't buy this one because you only get 36 and it's the same price. However, I just had to buy this one, um, the Glittery Pack. As I say, same price, you only get 36, but they are absolutely brilliant. Look at them. And I, I love silver. Even with jewellery, I prefer silver over gold. So I got those and I might do an individual review on these after. So that was three of the packs of the journal cards. I got these, I forget where I get, got these from, but I got four packets and they're a little bit on the bizarre side. But inside, the, the very good quality card very stiff card so I'll definitely be covering the front with something punching holes in and threading some ribbon and I'll either use them as um, they're not double sided with this pattern let me open the packet I'll be using them as journal tags or even gift tags there's the reverse but the real good quality although the bizarre design so that's those um, I bought this and that's a die, it says new home and what I'll be doing with that, 
I don't know if anyone's seen any of my 3D cottages that I make. Um, I've been putting gift tags on and giving, well, selling them and gifting them to people who move home. But I'm going to now die cut the words and hang that on the new on the chimney of the little 3D cottage. So that was a die I bought and that was quite reasonably priced. Also bought these. I've already bought a pack of these, but I'm making an album for my kids. And uh, I bought these to go on the pages. Little chalkboard. Love sentiments. So that's that. I also bought these. I don't know. Let me see if I can alter the camera. This is a 12 by 12. My mind's eye. Now and then. And I'm sure I've got the paper pads of this. And you get 38 chipboard elements. And I'll just go through what you get. And these are very, very thick. I did open these and have a look. These were full price, they weren't reduced. I don't buy everything, <laughs> I do pay full price sometimes. Nice little ship images there. And then coming up to my favourite, yeah, hot air balloons. So I got those. Um, I got me and my big ideas 12 by 12 paper pad. Uh, let's see what this is called. Oh, it says speciality paper. That's right. Some are foiled. Some, I think, are vellum. Some are, um, let's see what it says on the back. There. You get foil, glitter, UV coating, foil again, UV coating, glitter, foil, UV coating. So I'll just show you some of the designs. If anyone wants an individual uh, review of this paper pad, I don't mind doing that. The pages are brilliant. I love them. You know, I turned down some pads. I was looking at all the pads and some were... Some were nine ninety nine, and I'd open them, and they were just a load of rubbish. The designs were rubbish, and then I saw this right at the bottom, opened it, and I loved all the pages. I just loved them; they're brilliant. There's going to be very few pages in here that I don't use. It's called Speciality Papers, but it's uh, emphasises family, which is a plus. Look at that. Oh, I love that. And you get two pages of all the designs. Just flick through. If anyone wants a full review, just put it in the comments and I'll do that. There's another. So that was the uh, me and my big ideas. I do like these papers, the good quality. So I got that and then I just got this magazine yesterday and you get a load of freebies with it. First of all, an adult colouring book, a load of rubbish. I'll be gifting that to someone who likes that type of thing. I can't be bothered with that. Um, then I got a hunky-dory Christmas uh, pack. You get, sorry, I threw the label in after I'd gone through it all get loads of uh, Christmas inserts for Christmas cards and Christmas toppers and then I got this Stampin' Up uh, like holiday catalogue so I'll be enjoying looking through that and then you got the magazine I, I don't get any inspiration from the magazines at all but if they've got good gifts that's when I buy them and then I give the magazines on to people totally untouched. Oh, I've just dropped a load of stuff. And last but not least, 
I got a good deal on this. I go to a craft wholesalers in Wales and um, you can pick these blocks up for a few pounds. The dead thick premium card. This one, they have most colours. I usually get white, um, but the white was rubbish quality this time. It was like blotting paper. So I went for this silver, like a grey silver, and it's shimmering. And the quality is fantastic. And if you're using it for something that you're going to be covering covering with paper anyway, it doesn't matter. But um, I actually like that. I've made a few male Bertie cards with it so far. And you get a great big block like that. So that was just a few things that I've bought over the past week. Um, I'm going to do some more videos later on of some projects that I've made and uh, so stay tuned for that thanks for watching bye